Sports 10 has a new member joining us this year on Friday nights, and it's a guy the Wabash Valley is very familiar with, the, being that he grew up and played here. Everybody, welcome Jevin McCoskey, who took in the big game over at Turout South tonight. Take it away, Jevin. Thanks, Marty. I'm happy to be a part of the Sports 10 team. I was at Terre Haute South tonight, where the Braves faced defending 3A state champs Gibson Southern. South head coach Tim Heron always says he'll play any one, any time, and he's a man of his word, adding this game to the schedule. It was senior night for the Braves, and things got started fast as Nas McNeil got things going, returning the opening kickoff just past midfield. Now that long run would set up this touchdown from senior Josh Cotty, and the Braves would take an early 7-0 lead. How about some defensive highlights from Nas McNeil as he lays the boom on the Gibson Southern receiver and the, the Braves would get the ball back. On the very next drive, Josh Cotty enters the highlight reel again, taking this screen past 65 yards to the house. Cotty finished with 135 receiving yards, 100 rushing yards, and three touchdowns. Go ahead and celebrate just a little bit on that one. Another defensive highlight as Braves safety, Nick Casasilla is going to come up with this big interception to get the momentum back on Terre Haute South side off of the Gibson Southern quarterback to set up this final score from the Braves as Kati, for the first, second, and third time, took the direct snap, busted up the left side, and once again found the end zone. Now, the Braves would eventually fall to defending 3A state champs Gibson Southern 27-20 by a heartbreaking last-second score. Rick, Marty, back to you.